الله اكبر sit down both face to face okay good okay apni bhai sahab hum aap to dana diye dhoren bhabe par bolen ekdom shoda fekar kitab diye bolen ake tin shabdo ar amader god ache eto lomba allah god lagbe na inshallah bismillahir rahmanir rahim bismillahir rahmanir rahim amar me amar me sadia haq sadia haq মোহরানা তিন হাজার পাউন্ড সাব্যস্ত করে মোহরানা তিন হাজার পাউন্ড সাব্যস্ত করে তোমার কাছে নেকা দিলাম তোমার কাছে নেকা দিলাম তুমি নাবিল হাসান খান তুমি নাবিল হাসান খান পিতার নাম আইয়ুব খান পিতার নাম আইয়ুব খান তুমি তাকে স্ত্রী হিসেবে কবুল করো তুমি সাদিয়াকে স্ত্রী হিসেবে কবুল করো দিদি আন্ডারস্ট্যান্ড হাউ টু সে রিয়েলি ডোন্ট ইট আস মাশাআল্লাহ আমি সে আলহামদুলিল্লাহ আলহামদুলিল্লাহ কাবিল তুহা কাবিল তুহা আমি কবুল করলাম আলকুমার <laughs> 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 আমার আইফান ভাই 
He is a very successful father, alhamdulillah. He is the last son he got married today, mashallah. And this is a great achievement uh, in his life that his all children are married off, mashallah. He can be down now from <laughs> many things in the life, mashallah. Alhamdulillah. Okay, uh, marriage is a big name of Allah in our life. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned that it is one of his signs. I mean, ayat ibn yan khalaqa lakum min amfisikum azwaja. Of his signs that he, of his signs that he made for you, mates. So this marriage. Let us kun ilayha. We go to meet her, to start family life. You deserve from Allah to get sukun. And sukun is peace, rest, tranquility in the life. He placed between you in this relationship very special mawadda and rahma, born of love and affection and rahma, mercy. So, the mercy to each other, that is the, the sanction from Allah to us. But the sanction of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala of mercy, like jannah, like paradise. In the dunya, there will be some kind of little bit test in our life. That is true, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in the Quran again, لَيَغْلُوَكُمْ أَيُّكُمْ أَحْسَنُ amala. He will test you. Who is good in action, good in deed, good in dealing and transaction and behavior and mannerism. He will test it. And he created some weakness in us. وَخُلِقَ insanu ضَعِيفًا Insan is created with some weakness. No one is perfect in this world. That perfectness only belongs to Allah. Allah. So with some kind of uh, this, uh, you know, uh, imperfectness in our life, we need to uh, forgive each other, we need to correct ourselves, we need to reconcile, the enemy should come, will be having some kind of test between us. No one is immune from this test. Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he will be testing us. That's why with good people even, we'll have some issue between husband and wife, little bit in the morning after one hour, alhamdulillah, came back to normality. Today, little bit of tension, tomorrow morning is fine. So this is the normal course of the life. So don't live in the new couple, in a, in a, you know, in a world that you are living in a dream world. Married life all dream, no. Reality is some of the tension now and then will come. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will test us. Even Rasulullah <laughs> sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, Messenger of Allah, he and his wife gone through test. In one occasion he was decided to divorce his one of the wives. Hafsa radiallahu anha. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sent Jibreel alayhi salam, go give advice to my prophet not to divorce her. Allah. And he came, Ya Rasulullah, Hafsa, Imra'atun Sawamatun Qawwama, or Hijafi, Jatuka fi Jannah. She's a very pious lady, and she'll be your wife in Jannah. So keep her, Ya Rasulullah. If Rasulullah needed advice, Allah Akbar. Some kind of little bit problem he couldn't handle. So, how you and me can think, oh, everything should be perfect? That's why I got married here. Why all this problem? I cannot. Accept it anymore? No. This is the reality of the life. In younger occasion, your wife, he boycotted all of them. After one month uh, of this gap, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala <coughs> advised in the Quran our, to our mothers, uh, he revealed ayah to guide them that they need to, you know, a little bit compromise, they need to compromise their dunya, for the dunya they should not, you know, Give hard time to Rasulullah. Again, these are our mothers, Aisha, Zainab, Hafsa, Rajala, and Hunajamiya. What is their level? So these Allah, excuse me, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala made to happen in the life of Rasulullah to give us message. Look, don't live in dream world, in ideal world. The reality is you will have some problems now and then. And you need to pass in this test. Just, just come out and finish it quickly. You are angry, she is angry, an argument. This way, most of the times, you know, marriage are broken. <coughs> no sorrow. 
They live in dream world. They know there's a, there's a test in the life. Alhamdulillah. So this is a common you know, advice we need to give now, that especially young people here, they are very naive. They did not have all this experience of the life, which we have back home, seeing many of our people in the same village, same body, you know, all of them. Many people, our uncles are getting married, our cousins are getting married, learn from their experience. Here it doesn't happen that uh, society is different. That's why some of the young people are, uh, you know, sometimes very shocked and they easily give it up. That is uh, uh, not right. Second point I would like to focus in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Allah has taken one dollar. This you hear in all khutbah. In the Jummah and the Eid. Even khutbah is in the two, two times in your life. Jummah and Eid, Jummah and Eid. And third khutbah you hear in the Nikah, in the marriage. So this is, I, 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 I derive from there that Nikah is Ibadah, like Jummah is Ibadah, Eid is Ibadah. Subhanallah. Dear Shadi Ebadot, it's a junior matana, Koba, Rahat Karan, Buzakul, it's a Ebadot. Subhanallah. And Ebadat Kunturika put the how we perform our Ebadah? The way it was who 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 was Marriage in Islam, family life in Islam, whatever is the title, most of the books will be writing the main elements, components of the national life. You must go through. So you're aware of a duty and responsibility. You have some duty and responsibility. You have some right as well. She has some duties and responsibilities. She has some right as well. We need to know our right and then we need to know our duty as well. <coughs> And uh, in this journey, the husband is guided by Allah and by his messenger sallallahu Also, wife have some guidance as well. What is the guidance to the husband? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran, وَعَاشِرُهُنَّ بِالْمَعْرُوفِ Live the life with them, maintain the life with them with good manner. With good manner is good behavior. You need to understand and respect. And also, he sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, خَيْرُكُمْ خَيْرُكُمْ لِأَهْلِهِ وَأَنَا خَيْرُكُمْ لِأَهْلِهِ Best of you is the one who is good to his wife and I am good to my wife. So this is an advice to you. What is your advice to her? She should consider today you are her guardian. Her guardian of her parents. Today it came to you. You have this big responsibility. So that she needs to obey you, she needs to listen to you. She shouldn't disobey you, she don't be rebellious to you. This is one of her ibad. <coughs> Another hadith uh, for, for her, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, إِذَا صَلَّتِ خَمْسَهَا وَصَامَتْ شَهْرَهَا وَحَسِنَتْ فَرْجَهَا وَأَطَعَتْ زَوْجَهَا If a woman does four things, her daily Prayer, no compromise, have um, fasting of the month of Ramadan. It, 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 it is includes all her duty in her life and guarding her morality, akhlaq, chastity, character. And she's obeying her husband. All of the gates of the Jannah will be open to her. Subhanallah. So this is her uh, duty and guidance from Allah and His Messenger. Sallallahu so this way, both of you need to be aware of your duty and responsibility and attitude in the family life. And making sure you should become between husband and wife, and you should become between in-law. This is another challenge now and then it happens. We need to manage both. So today, uh, <coughs> Nabil and Sister uh, Sa uh, Sadia, both of you are married now. We should congratulate you. Uh, you know, but same time, we must tell you we have lost your freedom <laughs> and independence in the life. Okay? So she had every right to say, Nabil, why are you are late today? Mm, why you have been? Okay? She could be asking, who phoned you? You can't see this, my phone, my right, why are you interfering everything in my life? Allah. She had this right. 
Allah. I'm just funny somehow. You have every right to ask why you are funny. Although you don't doubt anything, but you have this question, a right of asking her. She should not be offended by that. Okay? So this is, we need to fully transfer. Very important. Fully transparent. No uh, doubt, no room of suspicion, no uh, nothing distant should happen between you. All transparent, and that is that way you, do, you close the door of shaitan. But if you're not transparent to each other, try to hide something from each other, then shaitan will find a good access to cause problem between you. Okay? So this is a, a, a very important thing that in the life we are very transparent and. Nowadays, another problem comes. Most of the times, people are busy with their device. And giving time to each other, you know, you work outside and come home, if you're busy with your device and all other things, that is not really right. That uh, she's writing to spend time to go to America to discuss, and to talk. If you're busy with your device with your f and friends outside, uh, I know you have a good number of friends. Mashallah. What is the number of friends you have now? <laughs> and come to. Okay. <laughs> Be careful, tell the, all of them goodbye from today. Mashallah. Okay, you need to focus uh, giving time to her. This is very important. She had right to get she came to be coming from leaving her home, staying here. You are the most close one. Although your parents and other people are there, but she had right to get time from you. So outside friend no. Some of the uh, people have very uh, friend culture, very bad culture. They spend sometimes you know, I get complaints. They come from home, you know, work outside, uh, you know, a whole day, and then came home and having, grabbing some food, going outside, spending time with a friend outside. This is very bad culture. Giving time at home is very important. Next point is, look, alhamdulillah, you attended Islamic school. I hope you learned some very, very good basic knowledge of Islam, but continue your learning Islamic knowledge is not finished. Carry on of learning. There will be situation in the life. You need to be, you need to be, um, you know, uh, rich with good Islamic knowledge. When some kind of difficulty will come in the family life, you can handle that, and you can uh, give some knowledge offering to your wife as well. So that's why you need to be more knowledgeable. Continue journey together. I recommend you to write, read a book called Riyadh Salihin, two volume. Have this book translated into English. Do you have the copy of these two books? No, no. Is there any good friend can him gift uh, him today? Inshallah, I'll give him. You're giving gift? Yes, I'll give him. Uh, 25 pounds maybe. No problem. Be careful. Inshallah. Okay. Yeah. It's gift from me, inshallah. Oh, God, Allah. Inshallah. Barakallah. You need to read them. He's sitting down together and reading this. Okay? Very good. You get all very good advice. Family life with them. Uh, how to control your anger. You know, how to, you know, uh, mashallah, improve your Islamic practice, ibadah. Now, shaitan is very active to make. He doesn't like marriage, he hates marriage. Because marriage protects people from immorality. He wants to break the marriage. <coughs> so you need to protect it with Allah. Subhanahu wa ta'ala, the rahmah, the knowledge will help you, the practice of will, 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 will uh, give you more power, inshallah, against shaitan. will empower you, everybody after the week. So that's the journey you continue, attend some Islamic circles, uh, you know, and listen to that. If you listen to anything from, uh, you know, media, uh, social media, then good Islamic talks only for both of you. Alhamdulillah. So this way, I hope and pray that, inshallah, you will enjoy good family life. And how you come back, inshallah, is retiring from all marriage. So I think that we give you responsibility. You'd like to share anything with us? I you come back? Yes, yes. Jazakumullah khairan um, for attending this uh, nikah of Nabil and uh, Sadia. Uh, so please make a dua for uh, both of them so that Allah is going to give them Amen. Uh, the blessings and uh, the marriage Amen. to continue and uh, be uh, prominent, inshallah. Amen. 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 Jazakumullah khairan. Shabay shabay ke khusan tam gubar ugar jana chi ke amra mahut yedda unushkane amra shabay shay chukdi di bere chi. আপনাদের কাছে অসংখ্য শুক্রিয়া আদায় করছি যে আপনারা যেন সবাই এসেছেন এর জন্য অসংখ্য ধন্যবাদ আর দোয়া করবেন আমার মেয়ের এবং ছেলের জন্য সবার জন্য সুখে জীবন যাপন করুন
so after they see her in privately, then you say, after salam, uh, can I say a dua to you now? You <coughs> say Bismillah and touch her forehead while you write her like this. And you say this dua, Allahumma inni as'alisa min khayriya khayri wa jawa ta'ali, a'udhu bi kum shadriya khayri wa jawa ta'ali, wa Allah, I ask you all good character, nature, and habit you have created her with. Wa Allah, I ask you protection from Amen. any bad nature, character, and habit you have created her with. Amen. This is a beautiful dua. You know which dua book you find it? Riyadh yeah. Salim. Do you have Muslim? Muslim, yes. Muslim? Do you have a, a personal copy? Yeah, I think you already sent it to Muslim. Yeah. <laughs> you sent it already. It's a new experience. Okay? <laughs> if you can find new ones, you got the fresh one now. <laughs> okay? So you go through a content page and mark it. Find out the dua and mark it here so it is ready with the mark. And it's in your pocket when you go to see her. Inshallah. And, open, and you can say the dua. Inshallah. Number two action. We pray to Raka Salah as Sahabi Abdullah in Mas'ud Radiallahu Anhu's recommendation to pray to Raka. Yeah, you could be as an Imam in front row, she will be in the back row. So, <coughs> to Raka Salah, just not an ordinary Raka Salah, and you can see it And third one, after that, both of you raise your hand to Allah. So Allah is very grateful to you for this beautiful name of marriage. And Allah give us Khair Baraka. And you know, this dua is very important. Every morning, this dua you need for your protection. She needs as well. Have two copies. Okay? The hard one as well. Keep every evening at least a few dua if you cannot read all of this. And before going to the bed, give her the protection against shaitan. And there's another dua you need later on. That is in the same page of the book, Mark that order to keep Shaitan away from your life. May Allah SWT stop it, inshallah, with the ears of your father Shaitan. As you are, Shaitan will be continuing the Dua, inshallah. Zakir, Shaitan, 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 Shaitan,